Hello and welcome to Catherine Hall. I'm Nadine Krempa and I'm the building principal of this amazing place. In fifth grade, our students will begin to transition from an elementary model into a more traditional middle school model. So they will take four core classes and transition to four different teachers throughout the day. So they may have math first period, they may have social studies second, science, and then language arts. Then they will go to lunch, they have a small recess, and then they will go to exploratory. Exploratory classes, students will cycle through a wide range of opportunities in several different areas. For example, in visual and performing arts, they will take visual art where they will paint and work with clay. Uh, they will take music and they will take dance. The students love it because it gives them an opportunity to engage in each subject area for a little bit and then move on to something new. At the end of the day then, we have something called power period. Power period is where students get some tutoring and some one-on-one -on -one help and where they can learn some of their character and leadership lessons as well. Each student here has his or her own device that is given to them from Milton Hershey. So fifth graders all have access to an iPad. So the expectation is just like they would bring their books to school, they bring their iPads to school. And what that does is it allows our teachers to really personalize learning and let students work at their own pace. So in fifth grade, because it is such an important transition year, we monitor progress very closely. We have quarterly report cards that go at the end of each marking period. We send progress reports home mid-marking period. We have diagnostic testing three times a year. So if a student is behind with reading, we will have the student come in for tutoring so they can get caught up on their skills. Some other ways that we address students' needs are through Saturday school and through summer school. Summer school is not meant to be punitive. It is not a punishment. It is a way for us to get students on grade level so that they can be successful for the next school year. So at Catherine Hall, we have a saying, we work hard and we play hard. We have a lot of opportunities to celebrate student success and to really encourage them to be kids and to have fun. So for example, we have marking period dances. So if students earn effort and conduct honor roll, which they should all earn, um, they can come to a function after school where they can dance, they can play games, they can do crafts, um, they can play some sports. We want to keep that going and we want to celebrate their successes and their growth. Some ways that you can help support us as a parent sponsor are a couple different ways. You can log on to Infinite Campus under the parent portal where you would have real-time access to your child's grades. Another way that you can be supportive and be helpful for the transition is to communicate with us directly. We welcome phone calls, we welcome emails, um, we welcome you to, to visit us and just simply support them and encourage them and say, you can do this, you can absolutely do this, keep trying, keep giving it your best, don't give up, and then you, know, you never know what they'll explore about themselves. 